here we are touring the Crothers Science and Nursing <laughs> Center. How exciting. I've got Jack and Doug with me today, and we want to show you what's happening inside of the building. So we got to get on our gear. Guys, ready? Get on your All gear. Right, let's go. These guys are going to make sure that we give the correct facts, like how many square feet, what's happening. And this will be the main entrance into the new addition. This is what you'll look like when you walk in. <laughs> You'll be smiling. Over there, donor wall. You'll have a monitor here, again, with information for students coming in, and this will be your donor wall. <laughs> this is your uh, student collaboration area. Glass partitions separating the two areas. Room is finished. I'm not sure what that means. I think this is the coolest room in the whole building because in the middle, the faculty sit and program so that the students can perform their simulation activities here. There will be a mannequin hooked up into these rooms that actually is a simulation mannequin and that there's a fluid transfer line that is behind each bed. There's microphones, there's cameras, there's ability for faculty to see it and then the students get to review the work that they did. So they'll be able to actually control fluids out of these mannequins. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> this is your bed lab again. We, we'll assimilate a hospital bed at 14 locations through here. Curtain rods so that they can be private. Hospital design is again putting windows in yes, so you patients have that get some daylight, but again it's up high so they have the privacy. We want our students learning exactly what they need to know to work in the hospital. Fighter, so you can separate the rooms and have two separate classes going on at the same time. We're gonna go check out biology. This is the cadaver room. Not to always be talking about fundraising, but we do not yet have a gift <laughs> to name the cadaver room. They their biology lab. Do you know what these are, Dina? I just know they're a big deal and you wanna have them. Expensive. And yes, and how many of them do we have in this building? 17 or 18. Looks like You're kidding. Yeah, a few shots of people. Standing here, I'm sure. So, what kind of room is this? Uh, NMR. NMR. Do we know what that's so for? Some not about magnetic. Right. I'm wishing the builders knew a little bit more about what they were building, but. We're in the chemistry side. I think one of the cool features of the Science and Nursing Center is the openness in the ceiling, correct? That's going to stay open where you see the pipes. So, look at the pipes. <laughs> I'd like a Big Mac, French fries, large Coke, Dina. Yeah, okay, yes. I'd like a, uh, let's see, a Whopper with cheese. Okay, the cool thing, though, is that if a faculty member was doing or a student, you can come out here and observe it, too, instead of being all hunched in there. <laughs> a cool storage room. Is that where the body is goes? Is that where the cadaver goes? Like, we're totally obsessed with this I don't this believe cadaver. so. I don't believe so. More red. <laughs> red. More red. It takes seven coats to make Robert's red. We've got probably three more coats to go on this <laughs> to make this really the right color. This looks like the women's. Is that the men's? Yes. We can verify it. I've totally just embarrassed everybody. And this is your tie in back to the existing building. Office space. Office, oh, this is the office. You're liking this. I know. That's exciting. Some of them can actually look back into their old offices. I know it's going to be hard to move from the Smith Science Building to over here, but you know, it's going to be okay. We've got the confocal microscope and optics right nice. here in the 203. I've got one of those at home. Yeah, okay, yeah. The silver portion is the actual unit, air handling unit itself. It's the larger unit. We got a snow melter, Dana. Did you know that? Okay. It goes outside and a whole bunch of two wings in the sidewalk and Eliminate shoveling. That's all you expected and more? Word on the street is we're on schedule. We are on schedule. Looking forward to opening on time. And it's actually been a good project for them. You know, not that it's their favorite campus to work on, but it's got to be at the top. It's my favorite campus to work oh, on. Oh, really? Absolutely. Okay, see, yeah, I didn't even fuel him that answer right there, but there you go. <laughs> good answer. Thank you. <laughs>